Harris fencing should be placed securely around the perimeter of the working site. Ensure pedestrian barriers are correctly attached together. Place a strut inner inside the outer and secure with a pin and R clip. Place the trench box panel on its back and carefully lower the assembled strut into the strut pockets. Secure with a pin and R clip. Attach the remaining struts into the three remaining pockets on the trench box panel. Using an excavator, gently lower the second trench box panel over the struts and secure using pins and R clips. With the box laying on timber skids on stable ground, attach a two leg chain to the handling points of the upper panel and using an excavator, orientate the trench box into a vertical position. All vehicle operators must have a permit to work on site. No permit, no dig. Mark out the digging area. Place pedestrian barriers around the excavation area. While digging, the spoil must be located away from the excavation and its zone of influence. Lower the assembled trench box into the excavation. Operatives to remove the chains only if the box upstand is one meter above ground level. These barriers are a temporary control measure to highlight the open excavation hazard. MGF edge safe should be attached to the trench box as soon as is practicable. Dig the next stage of the excavation. Using the excavator bucket, gently push down each corner of the trench box. Level off ground prior to movement of pedestrian barriers. Operative to check the correct dig depth. Using an excavator, lower the trench box top onto the trench box base. Operative behind the pedestrian barriers to attach the top to the base using pins and R clips either side of the trench box. Operative to remove chains from the top box. Using the excavator bucket, repeat the dig and push process. Behind pedestrian barriers, two operatives attach MGF edge safe and secure using pins and R clips. To close off the open ends of the trench walls, trench sheets or end safe panels can be used. Using the excavator quick hitch, gently push down on the trench sheet until it has reached the required depth. Install remaining sheets on either end of the excavation using the same procedure. Alternatively, lower an end safe panel on either end of the trench. If needed, use the excavator quick hitch to carefully push the panel until it reaches formation level. Repeat the process on the opposite end. Lower the ladder safe platform over the trench box panel and secure in place. The ladder must be one meter beyond the ladder pole. 
Secure the ladder with three metres of rope. 